Today on News Hub Nation, revelations about vulnerable patients discharged in the middle of the night. We have the exclusive figures. Minister Penny Henare with his response and Minister Aisha Viral on women's health. In two countries, two couples, a pandemic and a baby. A story of modern surrogacy. Good morning, I'm Tova O'Brien. And I'm Mihingarangi Forbes. Welcome to News Hub Nation. Jacinda Ardern accused the MIQ worker with COVID this week of lying about their vaccination status. The Prime Minister later said she may have been a little blunt. The Electoral Commission has referred the Māori Party to police after it failed to declare more than $300,000 in donations. Māori Party Vice President and donor John Tamihere isn't commenting while police investigate. And the government has outlined a range of proposals to end smoking in Aotearoa, including cutting the nicotine in each cigarette by up to 95%. First up today, Revelations. District health boards are routinely discharging elderly patients. Order. Order. That's all from us for now. Thanks for watching and thanks for joining me, Mihi. Well, tēnā koe whakawāti, tēnei tūnga mōku. Thanks for making space for me. Uh, hei kona mai, I'll see you here again next weekend. This program was made with the assistance of the New Zealand On Air Platinum Fund.